HBO has revealed that the highly anticipated final season of Game of Thrones will premiere on Sunday, April 14th at 9 p. M. The announcement, which came at the end of a teaser called Crypts of Winterfell, was made Sunday ahead of the third season premiere of HBO's True Detective. Season 8 will run for six episodes, one fewer than Season 7. What the final run lacks in number, however, it may make up in running time, individual episodes could run as long as 90 minutes. The April premiere date will also make Game of Thrones eligible for the 2019 Emmys. Season 7 took home 9 awards, including the honor for Outstanding Drama Series. The final season will feature a lean directing team of veteran Thrones Helmers David Nutter, the Red Wedding episode Reigns of Castamir, and Miguel Sapuknik, the hard-hitting Hard Home, as well as creators David Benioff and Dan Weiss, who are directing the finale. It is said that the final season will feature one episode that is wall-to-wall -wall action, containing the biggest battle sequence in series history. As for the final notes of the story, A Song of Ice and Fire author George R. R. Martin has long promised the tale will end on a bittersweet note. Prepare accordingly, tears, much like winter, are coming. When Game of Thrones last left off, West Eros was on the brink of its deadliest war yet. Jon Snow, Kit Harrington, Daenerys Targaryen, Amelia Clark, Tyrion Lannister, Peter Dinklage, and other legendary figures within the Thrones canon were able to cast aside their differences and work together toward fighting a common enemy, the Army of the Dead, led by the vicious Night King. Their show of unity may prove too little, too late, however, in the final scene of Season 7, the White Walkers burst through the Great Wall of West Arrows, finally launching their march on the Seven Kingdoms, with a zombified ice dragon in tow. Dot what's worse, the armies of the living are not yet at peace with one another, despite major strides in that direction. Look no further than Cersei Lannister, Lena Headey, who refuses to set aside her own self-interest for the sake of the survival of the species. Toward the end of Season 7, Cersei announced her intentions to hire a mercenary company to destroy the combined Stark and Targaryen forces. While the Night King poses the greatest threat at the moment, it would be a grave mistake to discount Cersei's deadly pettiness. Dot prepare for the end of Game of Thrones with The Hollywood Reporter's Final Path, a new series exploring the trajectory of each major character, plus final season projections, and follow THR. com slash Game of Thrones for continuing coverage.